Hey guys, it's Beano, and in the last part we got up to this kid. So we're gonna prepare for the duel, we're just gonna save. I may as well go with the same deck, because... He already got there, so he's being a cheapo and using those cards. Yeah, he's using the leg. Oh, come on. He's using the legendary cards already, so he's kind of got his original deck. Um, just a bunch of normal types, but he's got the uh, the legendaries on it, and I believe he's got Flareon and Vaporeon and Jolteon in there. Uh, so who am I gonna use? I'm gonna use, um... Who am I gonna use? I'm gonna go Meow. No. No, we're gonna go Lickitung. We're gonna go me out and Jotini, yeah. But yeah, um... <laughs> honestly, it is a difficult end game. But, if one can pull off. Commentary, 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 I need the commentary. Other than that, he's not terribly difficult. He doesn't really have too many mean Pokemon, so to speak. He's got the Dratini, Dragonair, Dragonite, he's got that, so... But other than that, he's just kind of got one of the rest. So, you know, it's not too bad. He's got two Moltres, okay, sure. But, um, you know, it's not too bad. It's definitely so mixed up because he's got he's dealing with three types now, so and I believe he's only got fire energy, so pretty much he can't use Vaporeon. Or Jolteon or Zapdos or Articuno. He can't use four of these cards. And the only other fire type he's got is the Flareon and the Moltres, so his strategy is weird. I think some of his better decks are the previous ones. So he's pretty much just draining his cards down. He's probably gonna use like a scoop up at the end of this. Jeez, whoever has a scoop up. Alright, so we got a lot of energies. I may as well put one on Tauros, because we're gonna get that Tauros up. So anyway, I ate a chicken. It was very nice. Nom, nom, nom. I am sorry, vegetarians, but I enjoy chicken. It's a fact of life. People enjoy things and other people don't. For those people who want to make people something else, see why they enjoy it, and if it's, and if it's rational, then you may as well leave it. Oh, Pokemon. Pokemon! Nobody eats Pokemon. Oh. Hold on, I can't use any of his moves. Actually, no! This may be the Vaporeon on the Jolteon that... This is the Jolteon that doesn't have... Yeah. He figured out how to get around that. Yeah, jerk face. I was about to say I'm doing surprisingly well, but I just realized that he... Pretty much just dodging his way out of this one. Why is he putting energies on now? He's not gonna get a chance to punch me. Unless if he's gonna switch out next to no he can't. Oh, cause I just did that. Unless if he scoops up, he's gonna scoop it up. Oh, no scoop up. Yes. Farfetch, jeez. Remember that guy? Yeah. Leak slap! Ah, uh, so yeah. Um... So since this is the last part, pretty much, 
I may as well just give my all round uh, things of the series. I did have my failures. Ah, <laughs> epic psych. Oh, he's gonna play it again. What the heck? <laughs> Double psych there. <laughs> oh, I know he's gonna deal 40 damage on me, but that is really, really good. That was so good. Oh gosh. Um, I'm just gonna get a little slap on that. Um. Oh my gosh. Um. Oh wait, I'm gonna die now. That's okay. That's okay. Look at Tucker isn't too great. He just has a lot of HP somehow. Oh come on, you're doing this again. Oh dang it. Oh. Why are you using your your rage? You. You're quake, you're doomed. I had to go there. I'm sorry. Pounce! So anyway, yeah. Um, yeah, overall, I think the series... The... Yeah, I'm like, I don't know, I call it a series. No, um... I think this Let's Play was actually very well... Very well handled. Um, I definitely knew what I was doing throughout it, and that's one thing I... I think is a good thing. In a Let's Play, if you're giving commentary, it's it's best if you have a lot of experience. If it's blind, then it's kind of bad because you don't want to talk over it. Oh. Yeah. Jack face. Kind of fancy how they have to get the game to do its own animation just for that one card. Just for the one card. Okay, so, I'm happy, we're three cards in, we're three prizes in, he's got his Moltres coming up though, and it's this Moltres, that's what's worried me. Come on, energy removal, yay, everybody likes that. What we can do, Gust of Wind, no, we shouldn't do good. Gust of Wind, we should save Gust of Wind until after we beat this guy. Anyway, yeah, um, I did have my failures. That was cool. Great. <laughs> Another energy removal. How handy. Um, yeah, I did have my failures, and they were kind of the bad points. But I think I did... I think I had a good job. I did a good job on the selfie. Just kind of keeping it up there. Um... Okay, Defender, because I really don't trust my luck here. In that case, he's gonna deal 40 damage if he hits. Or he can just completely waste it, okay. Um. Maybe it's just double colors on Porygon, I don't know. I don't feel like stalling, so I don't really feel like getting that Porygon out. Because I know I have two prizes left and all that stuff. Oh, he's got a Dragon Air coming. Ooh. Oh. Oh, thank goodness. Well, I am a jerk. But think about it, he's gonna do something with that later. I might as well take advantage of that opportunity. Yeah, I'm dead. That's okay, that's okay, because, you know, he's got four prizes left, I've got one. I'm surprised how well this this bit went. I'm surprised how well I just managed, I'm just managing to get through this end of the game, like, so smoothly. I think it's just because I, I, knew, I know what I'm doing. I know exactly what these cards are gonna do. I know what the AI is gonna try and cheap his way out with this. Dang it. Oh! <laughs> Oh my gosh! That will never happen again! That will never happen again! <laughs> that was such lucky, and now... Please, will I reuse Rampage? No. Go for stop! Back it up! Retreat! Too far fetched! Just go pot smash, yeah! I'm just surprised that I managed to get through these battles so quickly. Like, I don't know, I'd expect... I'd expect, um... Just 
a lot of failures. I didn't really fail that much. I only died once, pretty much. So anyway, Ronald lost, and that means... I am a true master. Anyway, we get to go around. You can also talk to these guys. The Hall of Honor. Anyway, then, they're so, they're so proud that this kid, like, beat them all. You man, you get to hold on to the floating as well. So anyway, yeah, so now we just go on an epic... Yeah, we get all four of these cards, so that's awesome. Um, only problem, the LP's further. You know, if you want to do this, like, if you're going to play against other people, like, in real life, with this, and I guess it's cool, yeah, Cause, especially because these cards pretty much just beat everything, so. Whoa, they're speaking! Oh, gosh. So, apparently, you're only a true player if you do stuff. Anyway, yeah, we won. You know, I'm fine with that. Why is it shaky? It shouldn't be shaking. Someone has a dodgy ROM. Ah, <laughs> oh, yeah. So, it was a good LP. It was, it was a good LP. I, I will... I will say that. I, um... I enjoyed it very much. As much as I got angry at some guys. It was, it was fun all around. Because you only get angry for like a moment. Um... That guy's a genius. No matter how few it was, because you had to hear that bell tune so much during this LP. Seriously, I would like to hear that ending battle tune a lot more. Because there's only like four battle tunes? Yeah. I mean, I know there's probably that many from the actual Pokemon game, but still. Oh yeah! We have these sprites and we never use them! No, seriously, they never used them, they were in the intro. And then again, there was the Psychic Energy had a weird picture in the intro. So yeah, anyway, um, I know I'm missing three of these promotional cards, but you know what, I told you how to get them. So... I may as well just say that. Special appearances? Here, my Cody! The world is good again! <laughs> nah, um... I think it's kind of odd why the sequel never came out in Australia. It may just be because they were trying to get that. There was a lot of translating to be done, and they were trying to get that Game Boy Advance out. And I think just by that time, yeah, it would have taken too long. Cards would have been out of date, especially because the Ruby and Sapphire cards would have been introduced and all that stuff. The timing would have just been bad. It's like um, it's like that game uh, by by these people that runs on the Doom engine. And like, they were trying to make it come out before Quake came out, because then it would just seem really bad, and eventually the game was so rushed, it was just so buggy and stuff. Except that then the developer actually found out that there were still people playing games running on the engine, so he decided, you know, 10 years later after selling it, make it free and make it awesome again, you know? I can't remember what that game is, but if you look it up in Doom Wiki, probably. But we're, we're, we're digressing. Um, yeah, I have no idea what I'm gonna LP next after after this off. Um, besides the Mario Galaxy versus thing, I'm not gonna take suggestions, but I'm gonna see if I can think of something. Because I I do prefer longer games, but not too long. Like, RPGs, uh, I don't know, they have... Hudson? Hudson made this? I had no clue, actually. Huh. Anyway, um... But yeah, I have no clue what I'm gonna be doing after this. Maybe another Pokemon game, I don't know. That may be a bit overcall on the Pokemon. So anyway, if you come back to the game, you will appear back in his lab. 
Oh, and you get this thing called the Tech Challenge. Now, some guy in the Let's Play, he actually, in his Let's Play, I remember, he, he showed this off. Basically, you gotta defeat five people. And, yeah. Other than that, that's about it. And then you can go around and collect your thingies. I don't know. I, don't, I, don't, I didn't really go to this, because, I don't know, I feel more inclined to do a uh, custom deck than a, than a set deck. As good as the set decks would be, they're not entirely the best. I also believe the challenge hall. Yeah, the challenge hall will do its own event, so you can try and win another one of those promotional arcanines. But other than that, there's not really that much to do after the game. Oh, you can fight the Pokemon over again if you want. Oh, oh, and someone's gonna yell at me, but. I don't need to talk to you again. Um, he tells you how to beat these guys. Which is annoying, because he only gives you the mails when you fight these guys. And he's like, this is my final gift for you. We got a polyrath, finally. Look at that, that is a good card, but unfortunately it's a bit too late. It's a party. We got 53, 43, 49, 46, and 15. And in the end, we were missing 20 cards. And we did that in 10 hours, which was pretty good. Okay, so I'll see you guys next LP. This carpet is pretty awesome, isn't it? I'm going to miss this game very much. Okay, see you guys later, the next LP that we're doing, maybe, yes, totally. okay I'll just end this!